Hi guys, this is gsmdom.com and I'm here with the Samsung Ativ S. This is the brand new Windows Phone 8 device from Samsung. It was actually the first Windows Phone 8 device announced even before Nokia Lumia 920 and HTC 8X. So basically we're dealing with uh, Samsung Galaxy S3 with uh, Windows Phone 8. That's a forced comparison. It's not exactly the Galaxy S3. It only has a diagonal size that's the same, 4.8 inches. And this model is supposed to cost 560 euro in the UK, as far as I heard. That's not a totally official price, but for now 560 euros. So this model, as I said, kind of a Galaxy S3 with Windows Phone 8 on board, the latest Windows Phone release. And we have a Super AMOLED HD screen available right here. Uh, the phone is 8.7 mm thick and we're previewing it now, so it's not a review, it's a preview for now. We'll be back with a full review in the next couple of days. We should also know that the device weighs 135 grams. So it's actually pretty light considering the Nokia Lumia 920 is 185 grams. This model is actually pretty nice as far as design goes. I was very impressed. I like the design even more than the Galaxy S3, I have to say that. The back side has a fake metal back, if I can call it, it's, uh, call it that way. I can call it faux metal since it tricks you to think that it's metal but in fact it's plastic it's actually a pretty nice idea from Samsung um, also keep in mind that this is the new series from Samsung the Ativ series, we have the Samsung Ativ S, we also got a tablet and a bunch more devices um, this model supports full HD playback it has a dual core Snapdragon 1.5 GHz CPU inside Lithium-ion 2300 mAh battery and an 8 megapixel camera at the back that does 1080p capture. Up front we've got a 1.9 megapixel camera and there's a good thing here, finally on a Windows Phone device we have a micro SD card slot. So let's remove the back cover. You thought it was metal but turns out it was plastic. So pretty nice gimmick. Here's the micro SIM card slot, this is the micro SD card slot and this is the battery I was telling you about. It even has NFC, if you can believe it. And uh, once again, the first Windows Phone 8 device to be revealed and the first Windows Phone 8 device that we received for testing purposes. Notice the beautiful design and the edge of the glass on this device. Uh, it seems to be slightly curved and also this faux metal back, they really thought this through and made a very beautiful device, the folks at Samsung. We also got this uh, Windows button right here at the center and the back button and the search button, the earpiece at the top and 8 megapixel camera and LED flash, audio jack, volume button and on off button on the side as well as the camera button. So let's trigger the camera, pressing the camera button, we have this pen, we can also see the interface of the camera on this occasion and the slight changes it has, photo settings and video settings, you can do 1080p capture a bunch of photo settings right here, focus mode, anti-shake, white balance and other stuff like that. So basically we're dealing with a reinvented Samsung Windows Phone 8 device. It's a huge evolution from the Samsung Omnia 7 if you ask me. It jumped an entire generation and it's totally changed and it's nice to see that the 4.8 inch format from the Galaxy S3 has moved to the Windows Phone world. And this is the dialer in case you're wondering. We also got Internet Explorer in the Windows Phone 8 version with the address bar at the bottom. This is the virtual keyboard. I'm accessing gsndome.com. .com. Here we are. This browser has become famous for its speed. Also, Internet Explorer 10 is also pretty fast, working on Windows RT and Windows 8. Very good pinch to zoom, very good behavior of the screen. I can't wait to see how it behaves in full sunlight. But till then I'm going to show you the accessories that came with this device. This is a prototype device for testing purposes, so that's why we didn't perform an unboxing, but that will not stop me from showing you the accessories. So we've got the headphones right here. Reminds me of the headphones we got with the Galaxy Note devices and of course we got a charger, some plugs for the earphones and obviously the USB cable for this device. 
So overall a first impression that's very very good. My impression stands. It's a Galaxy S3 with Windows Phone 8, HD 4.8 inch display, dual core Snapdragon 1.5 GHz CPU, bright and crisp screen, very good colors. Speaking of colors, let's access the photos on board here, zoom in a bit, see some brilliant colors. No pixels, so it's actually a very good screen for the first impression. And I like the fact that we have a micro SD card slot available on this device, also micro SIM. Also these small squares that you see right here, the tiles have now been diversified and they're available in more sizes than just one. Also get a calendar filled with our Facebook events. And there's a special area in the people section that's dedicated to groups and rooms, but more about that in the full review coming in a bunch of days. Samsung Active S 564 Euro, at least in the UK, Windows Phone 8 device with a pretty good potential. That's it from gsnnone.com, bye bye.